Paddington strikes a chord with everyone. We have a guest for the night, uh, a bear. He's an explorer in a strange place that he hopes he's going to find welcoming. London is so important to him, to the stories. Although he comes from darkest Peru, he settled in London. The truth is he has, over the years, become a bit of an icon. Grizzly, not particularly. Mind you, I haven't seen him in the mornings. This trail is a wonderful way of bringing that to life. In a way, you can be like Paddington, a great explorer. The Paddington Trail is going to be 50 bears all around London in various landmarks, of course, iconically at Paddington Station itself, and there will be trails you can follow to find each one. What's going to happen with these bears is they're going to be auctioned off, and the proceeds of the auction are going to go towards the NSPCC. The NSPCC is as much part of the fabric of Britain as Paddington has become. The NSPCC are the Mr and Mrs Brown for children who are at risk of being neglected. We want every child to have a really wonderful start in life. And so I think it's a perfect marriage of a wonderful charity and an adorable, iconic figure. You'll be able to explore the city going from Paddington to Paddington. This is a great way to navigate London, to see the sights, to follow this bear on his journey as he works his way through the streets and see all the obvious tourist attractions, Trafalgar Square, Leicester Square, but also some of the alleyways and byways that they might otherwise not have gone to. Of course, you can take photographs of them, photograph yourself with Paddington, you can upload them onto the internet. You can go to the Visit London website. The Visit London will be the digital partner, if you like, guiding them through where they are. It'll be wonderful for visitors. It'll be a bit of fun for Londoners as well to spot them all around town. I hope this trail will make people look at London with fresh, open eyes.